Hi YouTube, it is Stephanie here. Um, I have a quick haul for you. Um, it is a couple things that I picked up at Target and uh, Staples mostly uh, because I had to pick up some printer ink and a new binder so I picked up some other things while I was in the area. Uh, the first thing I'm going to show you is not really file facts related, but I thought it was really cool, so I thought I'd show you guys. And basically, it is the bobble water bottle, and this top part is a filter, so when you fill it with uh, water from a tap or a water fountain, it filters out um, stuff that you don't want to drink. <laughs> um, and it, it was just, it was cheaper than uh, what I assumed they would be. Um, I'm not sure if that's true or not. It was only $12.99 for a one liter bottle, which was great. Uh, it's replacing this old guy. It's got all the Disney villains on it, and I absolutely adore it, but it's come to a point where I can't use it anymore. Cruella de Vil used to be here, which is fine. I don't really care about her anyway. There's Ursula. But um, it's dented at the bottom, if you can see. I don't know if you can tell. Yeah. It's pretty dented. It doesn't stand straight. I think you can see it wobbling on my desk. And the mouth thing is cracked. So it leaks and stuff, and uh, it was fine before, but now that it's cracked, it's not a good look to have spilling all over my bag and stuff. So yeah, I bought a new water bottle. The next thing I got at Target was these two Inkjoy pens from Papermate. I already opened it because I wanted to try them out, but uh, they seem okay. I'll have to, like, I don't really know how I like a pen until I write with it a lot for a long period of time, like when I'm taking notes or something, so we'll see how they go. I'll let you guys know in the future what I think. Uh, they were relatively cheap, so two bucks a pen, I guess. All right, so I also went to Staples because I needed printer ink, so I just got printer ink for my printer. I can't believe how expensive this stuff is now. 40 bucks for two cartridges, like that's ridiculous. And they don't last very long either, which sucks. Um, I also bought a new flex binder because my last one, the middle ring snapped and doesn't work anymore. Um, I'm not a big fan of zipped binders and stuff, but this was cheaper than the regular one, which is ridiculous because, I mean, it's the same thing. Oh, look at that. It's got a pocket here. That's so cool. I didn't even know that. Um, but yeah, and it's got a pen loop inside as well. I don't know if you can see. You can't see that. Sorry, guys. But um, yeah, and I love the color. Anyway, that was only like $11, and the regular ones... Oh, it's too far. The regular ones that don't zip are $13, so I thought I would try that out and see if I like the zipper ones better. But yeah, I got that. I also got this just a regular twin pocket folder. What I like about these, um, first of all, they're really cheap. And second, they're, the holes are torn so you can put it in a binder and rip it out as you need. And I did that myself with a binder, or sorry, a folder that's similar to this. Um, I just cut the holes, or no, I punched holes and then I cut it. But it depends on the folder that you have, like some can handle it and some don't. So I like the fact that they're selling ones that are already done like that for really cheap. What else did I get? I got a bunch of stuff on clearance at Staples, so I'll show you that. They're all note tabs. So I got these note tabs from Post-It. Um, and this is a really interesting, they come with 50 tabs, which I was really impressed with, and I love the colors. Not usually a fan of pink, but it's more of a, you can't tell it looks pink, but it's more of a coral color, like my shirt, um, but a little bit lighter. Uh, so yeah, I thought that was really great. And that was only $2.97, so for 50 tabs, how can you go wrong? Uh, then I got some note, um, Avery note tabs, and these ones are the same size as those, but they're transparent, and I'm pretty sure... Yeah, it's only blue, which sucks because I hate blue, but that's fine. Uh, let me just see how much are in here. Ten. There's only ten in here, but it was only 99 cents or 97 cents, so I thought that was a good deal. Always, <coughs> always check out the clearance section in your staples because you never know when they're going to have some stuff that's on sale that you're interested in. Like, 
Um, my Staples, the last time I was there, they, they didn't have Avery note tabs on sale, so and they didn't have these on sale either. So that was really exciting to see that. It's like finding gold. It's awesome. Um, but they don't sell the Martha Stewart post-it notes at my Staples, which is driving me nuts because they have all the other Martha Stewart stuff. They have or stuff. They have the do drop label things and they've got everything else that you would possibly want except for the the post-it notes anyway so that's really upsetting but these were also only 99 or 97 cents uh they're the green and blue circle transparent tabs or oval half oval yeah half oval i don't know how many is in here because the 20 pack 20 in here and I just I bought it mostly for the green ones because I, I like green more than I like blue um, here I'll show you I've got I because I have the pink and blue tab but I'm not a big fan of blue like I'll deal with it if I have to but I think the the pink and the green would be really yeah be really nice together so yay um the last thing I got was a 36 pack of the big tabs. Now I have no idea what I'm gonna use these for, but they were only, again, they were only 97 cents. So I thought that would be a really cool deal. And I love the red and the yellow. So yeah, note tabs, really cool. I've got a bunch of them now. I will never need note tabs ever again in my life. Um, because I'm really like, I'm really stingy when it comes to these tabs because regularly they're really expensive. Like I keep saying like in this video, I apologize for that. You can tell that this one has been used a couple times because I use the friction pens on these so that I can change it if I decide that I don't want it there anymore or I don't want it to say what it says. Um, but this was on my one of my dividers. You can see how dirty it looks. Um, and it picked up the ink. So the transparent part of it is getting really gross. So maybe I'll stop reusing them since I got a whole bunch of these on sale. But yeah, that is all for my haul. Surprisingly, that was a whole seven minutes. Wow, that's pretty crazy. I will post an update video on my file facts by the end of the week probably um, when this week is over maybe Monday next week just because I feel incomplete showing an update of my file facts when only half the week is over um, but yeah that is everything I have to share with you guys today I hope you enjoyed and um, it's really nice outside where I am so I hope it's really nice outside where you are and if it is Go outside and enjoy the weather. Have a good one, guys. Bye now.